As you know, your father has what I call a quiet, persistent charisma. But he's no JFK, he's no Ronald Reagan, and yet he became president of the United States because person after person at every stage in his life, almost anyone who met him, with some exceptions we can damn near count on one hand, believed that he was someone in whose hands the affairs of the nation and the world would be safe. And that's a particular kind of gift, a particular kind of charisma that doesn't fit into the usual categories. And so your dad created a much more difficult literary task in writing about him, which you know because you did it. Yeah, but mine was a little different perspective. It was, yeah. Starting with you were never president. <laughs> And the world is a lot better off because yeah, of well. it, I can assure you. Yeah.